Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to create some flashing lights in Roblox Studio. So first off, let me do the preview of how it's going to look like when you're done. So lights are going to be flashing alternating like this. Um, they can also be adjusted too with the script. So let's just delete these. Spawn in a random shape or the, for example, I'm going to be using a cylinder. Um, haven't used Roblox in a long time as usual. I use Blender. So... And then that's going to be the light, for example. Let me just color that red real quick. Red, this is going to be light one, and this is going to be the second light. And then there's going to be a box over here, which is going to be the relay. This is going to be the relay box, for example. This is where it's going to get, contain the script and all that stuff. So light one, light two. Uh, head on over to this right here. As you can see, it says name. And then, for example, let's just do light one. No spaces, always remember that. No spaces, otherwise the script is not going to work. So it needs to be together like that. Um, light 2. And we're just going to name this Flasher. This is going to contain the script and it's going to input it into these two so they can alternate. Let's do it. So you got 1, 2. You also rename them by double clicking, but for some reason I can't do that. Ah, there we go. You can see you rename it by double clicking in case you don't have this tab right here. Um, okay, let's get on with the script. Hit on to the plus sign right here and then click script. This will create um, this blank page as you can see. Uh, I'm going to be showing you how to create the wild true do script. Um, I'll make a disable script in the next video if I can, uh, if you guys want some, you know, more. Um, so while true do all lower cases and you hit enter and it automatically cr creates a loop you can tell by that end if there's two ends then it's just one loop but if it's uh if it's one end then it's uh it's it's a complete loop so script parent oops that needs to be uppercase there we go parent dot light one it already shows up right here so dot material I'm going to be using neon as an example. So make sure to have these quotation marks and then put neon with a capital letter. I don't think it really matters, but I'm just going to do it anyway. And so light one is neon. And um, let's do this. Light two is going to be plastic because it's going to be turned off. You know, it's going to be alternating. Um, so this is going to be plastic. So there you go. Now you just need to wait. And then you input your number here, for example. I'm going to do like 0 0.5. Oops, oops. Uh, don't do that. Don't hit enter. Go outside, then hit enter. I think you can uh, just copy this entire script right here. And then, uh, you know, just do the same thing. Make this plastic because this needs to alternate. Pl plastic. Pla oops. Plastic. There we go. And this is going to be neon. So pretty much now I have an alternating script. Let's see if it works. I probably made some mistakes, but I think this should work. I'm just going to make an uneven relay, like, you know, 959. Nine. Let's try that out. So it should alternate now. Well, there you have it. You have an alternating... Uh, flasher now. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video and uh, let me know if you need more tutorials like this. Bye.